It was a big day economically for the city of Findlay and Hancock County as the grand opening of MeTech Automotive was held on Fostoria Avenue. Several dignitaries on hand, including Governor John Kasich and the CEO of the company, and Michael Mielitzer. And if you see the plan, it looks a little bit empty. Uh, I promise all of our plants during the last years, they grow and grow and sometimes they have to, to uh, expand. Company founder and CEO Michael Mielitzer is saying that they don't plan to stay small in Finley for very long. They'd like to aggressively expand. But why did Metech choose Finley out of hundreds of possible locations? Mielitzer's son and Metech board member Christoph explained. As we mentioned, more than 100 were checked and uh, it was just the best fit uh, on hard and soft facts and uh, warm reception of community, um, skilled labor available, ideally located. We're good. Governor John Kasich giving remarks while at today's event. He said this is the beginning of a good relationship with this Germany. This is a foreign investment by a great German company. And he will go back to Germany and because of the way he's been treated and um, because of the fact that we're going to be business friendly and help them in a variety of ways, he's going to tell other German companies to come here. Finley Hancock County Alliance was a big part in bringing MeTech here, and President and CEO John Haywood said that the company and the state were great to work with, especially when another piece of economic development threatened MeTech's ability to come to Finley. They were looking for a building, and they were very much at the same time that Hamlet was looking for a building, and Hamlet happened to buy the available old Cardinal <laughs> Health building at that time, and so we were kind of scrambling. MeTech was kind of scrambling, looking for a spot. So. Uh, Tony, uh, Tony Riddy, Tim Miley did a great job of finding this location and working out uh, a, a place for MeTech to set up. Now the goal is to start off small and work their way into the size of the building. Dr. Mielitz are telling us beforehand that they plan to fill it pretty quickly. I'm Doug Jenkins reporting.